Hello children. Today I'm going to talk about ask and answer questions. Do you like to ask questions? Like what do we have for dinner? Why is this trip never ending? Why does my brother want to bug me? Yes, you ask questions all the time. Isn't it fun? I think so. Now let's use the skill of asking and answering questions to make boring reading passages actually fun. Let's do it. The first fun thing to do is to fill out a graphic organizer. This is fun. It's colorful. It has a center that holds everything together and it is holding together the question words who, why, how, when, and what. That's fun. Now let's use the question words, this beautiful graphic organizer, to make a boring passage fun. I will show you how to make it fun. Now we have a passage and a graphic organizer. This says kids and ch chores? That, that's boring. Chores. Ah, I don't want to learn about chores. I don't want to do chores. Okay, I will play along. So the first question word is who? Let's look at the very first sentence. Doctors say, oh, so doctors are the who. Who says something about the chores? Okay, and there is another answer to the question word why. Oh, doctors say something about the chores to get kids moving. Okay, okay, I got it. But what exactly do doctors say? They say it is important for kids to do chores. Uh-huh. They also see how kids sh could do chores. They could share housework with siblings and their parents could guide them. I understand. I understand. There is another why. Why should kids do chores? For the future. To be prepared to be a grown-up. That was easy and that was not as boring. It was very colorful. So you just had to fill out these question bubbles. Who? Doctors say why to get moving, what to do chores, why for the future, and how by sharing chores. So in the future, when you read something boring like chores, womp womp, just think about the right questions to ask to locate the important information. But what is the passage about? Kids and chores. Who does it talk about? It talks about kids. It also talks about who says chores are important. What is the main idea it wants you to take away from the passage about doing chores? It says important reasons to get moving for the future. So it tells you all these important little things using fun bubble chart. And you can take away the important ideas and learn about a boring topic. Now that we know. We can do that. Let's apply this whenever we read a difficult, a boring, or maybe a long passage. Ask the right questions, answer them, and understand the passage better. I will talk to you more later, my smart little children.